Hi, and welcome to my new studio. I'm really excited about it, and I'd love to show it to you. Let's get into it, as my girlfriend would say. So first of all, why a new studio? So like many people, my first studio was set up in a corner of the bedroom. We live on an exceptionally busy road. The bedroom's at the very back of the property. It's the quietest place, which was great most of the time. But if I'm talking, yeah, it was a bit echoey. With this, hello, pretty good. The other reason I decided to move was my darling, long-suffering husband, Martin, who never complains. So occasionally I would have a really early morning for a Zoom tutorial or to hang out with the guys from the tenor guitar workshop. And it either meant Martin had to get up really, really early and go and watch TV in the lounge room, or I'd wake him up, walk him half asleep into the spare bedroom, put him into the bed, close the door, and hopefully not disturb him. Not ideal. So those and a few other reasons I decided it was time for the big move. So last weekend, thank you very much Martin, moved in here. I'm mostly set up. I'm not a hundred percent set up, but I am thrilled. First of all, can you tell I'm not wearing makeup? Lie if you can. No, just kidding. I'm not wearing makeup. Outside here, which you'll see from the still photos, there's actually a double window in front of me, so I'm getting lots of gorgeous natural light. Now there's the two windows, there is a pathway down the side of the house, and then there is the red brick building of the property next door, which is fantastic, because as a photographer, I can tell you the most flattering light is diffused light. So the sun is coming down, it's bouncing off the red brick, and bouncing in through my windows to me. Now because it's hitting the red brick, even though our eye can't see it, the light is slightly colored with a little pink hue. And this is what's giving me what I think is a great look. So that's a great time saving thing for me. No makeup, brilliant. But it also means I can make these videos. I can have all my stuff around me. The lighting is great for videos. There's a lot of stuff off camera you can't see right there hanging on the wall thank you martin for putting the guitar hooks up and my two beautiful steel string pono bar baritones so they're off the floor but they're still within reach so two beautiful ponos there along this wall which you'll see from the photo i have a long row of acoustic treatment I will do a video at a later stage to talk about the different ways I've done my acoustic treatment. Right down here, just, just off camera, on the ground, on a stand, I have my two beautiful Blue Ridge tenor guitars, which I adore. I also have a big Vesta amplifier, which you, is off camera, which I use when I'm playing my cigar box guitar, which you can see hanging on the wall there in the corner. I've also got a bass amp and a few other bits and pieces. I'm really not quite set up yet. Then I've got my lovely background that you will have recognized from previous videos. My latest book, which you should all buy. And then this brings us to this side. And this is really the admin work side. So I've got my beautiful cats. I've got all my extra equipment. I've got all my music books, chords, my concertina, which I really should play more often. Printer, the books that I use regularly are just down here. And then I've got my lamp my two monitors, my fabulous speakers, and everything else, my mixer that you'll see. Uh, you'll also see there's two huge vertical acoustic treatment panels there. Again, I will do an acoustic treatment video at a later stage, but right now I just want to say, hey, new studio, it's so fabulous. So there you go. There is my studio, and I am loving it and probably spending too much time here, but that's okay. If you have any questions, please leave me a comment below. I would be happy to answer them. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you later.